MRSA has become synonymous with hospitals due to the quantity of vulnerable individuals in close proximity. Bacteria can easily spread between patients and with existing strains containing mutations that are antibiotic resistant combining with new strains, a vastly accelerated evolution can take place. MRSA can be symptomless in some individuals, but typically symptoms will include tenderness, discoloration, swelling and suppuration. Wounds may not heal at typical rates and the patient may feel nauseous, weak and may develop a fever. MRSA symptoms may vary depending on the location of the infection. Common areas for infection to occur include burns, the blood, catheter areas, eyes and surgical wounds. Because MRSA is more likely to attack those with pre-existing conditions, such as infections or wounds, it is critical to get urgent treatment to avoid further deterioration in the patient's overall health and avoid chronic disability. To date, MRSA remains susceptible to antibiotics, although studies indicate the likelihood of a time when an entirely resistant strain emerges. Typically, considerably higher quantities of antibiotics over a longer duration, often administered intravenously, will be necessary to combat it. This can mean greater discomfort to the patient.